We are still here at the OK Do stand at Electronica 2022, and I am here chatting with Paul from Debix. Now, this is a very interesting board that you've done in collaboration with OK Do. There's a, a level of customization to this board, isn't there? That's correct. Yeah. We have a very high degree of customization, mm -hmm. and we do have support even ranging from the engineering and software and hardware, we can all provide that. So um, what was the sort of idea behind this? Because most SBCs, they come with a very set set of parameters and they come with a very set uh, software development uh, side of things. So from a hobbyist's kind of perspective, um, what kind of advantages are there to having a fully customizable board? I think one major advantage is this concept kind of was arising from the need of industrial solutions. And I do believe some very popular SBCs that I'm not going to name any names, they kind of don't fulfill that requirement. So for example, whether it's a long supply cycle that industrial users might need 10, 15 years, we can provide it, but the others cannot, as well as um, much higher vehicle grade operating temperature ranges. For example, this SBC right here, we have two versions that can go up to minus 40, up to 85 degrees, every component on it. Okay, yeah. And, um, and when it comes to say, if I today wanted to get one of these boards and I went to the OKDo OK website, what level of customizability would I kind of be able to find as just a hobby user? So as a hobby user, you can find uh, different configurations yeah. for such, such things as RAM and the storage options. And I do believe there are also some limited support for IO, but with us, you can also come to the supplier yeah. or contact OKDo OK more directly yeah, yeah for your requirement sheets, make a list for us and we will be able to arrange it for you. Absolutely, well thanks so much for chatting to me today, that's great. And yeah, for, for me I find this uh, like a really interesting thing. Customizable SBCs aren't necessarily new, but it's not necessarily something that us, the hobbyists, have had our hands on for very long. And this is a very cool looking little board.